describe your idea of what the Kinetic Sculpture Race is all about? Um, the Kinetic Sculpture Race is a time to have a lot of fun, people to get together and show off their machines that they've been working with all year. It's a weekend for thrills, chills, and adventure. The Kinetic Sculpture Race, it's all about uh, having fun and going for the glory and decided to enter because we've been doing it for 13 years and kind of got hooked. Uh, it's for the glory, and it's the only human people around. My girlfriend leaves me, and I'm homeless, and nowhere to go, and here I can find myself. So, the race was started by Hobart Broom 25 years ago, and the race will start here in the Arcada Plaza, and then on Monday they will end up in Ferndale in the afternoon. This is where we're going to all head down. They're doing the teddy bear check and the brake check right here as we talk. And this is also where they begin in their world famous 25th annual kinetic sculpture race. And soon, at high noon, in, va in fact, seven minutes from now, we will be heading down this road and going crazy. What exactly is the brake check and the teddy bear check? Oh, it's most important. What would the kinetic sculptures be without brakes? Running over all these pedestrians in the streets, going down the slippery dunes without no brakes. Oh, oh, couldn't be. You have to have that brace. And for security, you must have a teddy bear. Teddy bears are a vital, important thing in this race. At what point of the race are we right now, and what do the racers have to accomplish here? We are at Dead Man's Drop. Dead Man's Drop is a timeout when they get up the hill, and I'm sitting at the time in. And what they have to accomplish here is going down a very steep grade to the bottom and maintaining their brakes, and then going on out finishing the dune part, which is very sandy. Do a lot of racers have problems with this point? They can have trouble coming up the hill once they make it to the top. Like I said, what they have to keep when they're going down the hill is their brakes. And hopefully no one wipes out at the bottom. How's the race going so far? The race is going real well. We just made it here, didn't we? We're at the top of Dead Man's Drop. Let's go! What's the purpose of the Old Town Barbecue Teddy Bear Picnic? The 
purpose of the teddy bear picnic is for our teddy bears who live here to come out and cheer their brethren on board the sculptures for the teddy bears uh, for the kinetic sculpture race. Because as you know, there needs to be a teddy bear on every sculpture. And our teddies, and this by the way is a bear, boss bear of the inn, come out every year to cheer on teddy bears as well as other kinetic sculptures. Besides that, the people have a lot of fun. I noticed that the races took off pretty early, around 9 a.m. this morning. Do the racers get breakfast, or how is that taken care of? Well, they're all hungry after using up all their energy on yesterday's race and party and party last night. They're exhausted, and they have to go to McDonald's. And, of course, you can't get one of these big machines into one of those buildings. So what do they do with the Kinect sculpture? They go through the drive-up. Can you imagine the teller's surprise when they order a double, double Mc cheeseburger for breakfast on the go. They're in a hurry, you know. They've got to get down here and hit that water. It's a sink or swim situation today. What's your opinion of this year's race? The weather's a lot better. There's one machine that would have made it a much greater race, mine. <laughs> Actually, no, it's a great race. This is a, this is a neat one. And today, hopefully, the people that go out in the bay will have a good time. So it looks, it's really great to have a good weather. <laughs> some of the obstacles that the racers have to accomplish today? Well, the Eel River Slough, the Eel River, after Cock Robin Island, get over here to the approach to Slimy Slope and then make it through this lovely trail. What exactly is this lovely trail here? This is Slimy Slope. And what do they have to do? They have to get through? Well, they have to get through, but they're allowing a legal push from where I place that sign until they get to the top of the slope. <laughs>
planet is not raining. Uh, I'm hungry. Uh, I'm thirsty. I'm tired. I want, it. I want my hot tub. What's going through my head right now is what will next year? We didn't do quite as well this year as we had hoped. Uh, we've aced it in the past. This year we didn't. And uh, we picked up a lot of good design details, so though. That's, that's the name of the game. So you're showing up next year for sure? Oh, yeah. It'll be here next year. Better than ever. Turn into down. You don't need no brakes to stop.